Hello guys, if you are looking for changing label or set a text to your label from another class, you are in the right video. For example, we have this label and you want to change it from this. For example, I will type Corona virus. Click to change. As you see, it's changed. You will now, for example, click test. Click to change. So, if you want to know how to do this, follow this video. Well, I created JavaFX project. I need me to test it inside this JavaFX project. I have two fixed files, page one and page two, and three classes. The main of project and the controller class for page one and the controller class for page two. So, inside the page one, I have a text field and a button. I give the name to the text field and I give the name to the action of button. Then in the page two, I have this label. So this label will be changed. So I give the name to this label. Well, I have a main class and the control class two and the control for page two. So when I click run, we load the page one and the page two. To load two pages, you have to go to the main class of your project and load the page one. And then I want to do initialize method of the page one and I load it to page two. So I'm gonna make this video very shortly. So we're gonna go directly and show you how to change the label of the page one so when you make this label static will be there many many errors in your project so all what you have to do is just uh, declare a new lay a new static label like this public sorry what i did what's this <laughs> uh, public static label and they will give it a name like static static label static label right and then go to the initialize method of your page two for example for me it's it's page two and then type static label equal a label of your fxml file so here we have in the initialize method static label it's a static label equal the label of your fxml file i think everything is clear then go to the controller of page one for me I created page one and page two. Then, <coughs> excuse me, then extend the controller of the page two. And then go to your method for me, it's a button action. So I will write static. It's static label dot set text. It's the and you call it text fill dot get text. All right, I think everything is clear here. So we will try to run the program. Click run. I have page one and page two. For example, I will type <coughs> Ala Madrid change. Oh, great, it's changed. Uh, coronavirus. Click to change. As you see, guys, it's very clear and nicely and shortly. So the trick is to go to your 
for example I, I for me I have pages in the page 2 this label I want and I want to this label to be changing so go to your initialize and uh, before initialize declare your label uh, a new label as a static and give it a name and inside initialize type that label equal your label of your fxml file then go to the other class and don't forget to extend the controller class of that of that fxml file and then go to your method and and type this static label dot set text text field dot get text so guys i hope you enjoyed and like this video and i solved your problem thanks for your watching don't forget to subscribe in my channel goodbye